morning everybody and this is our last full day so um, yeah we've had a nice lazy morning uh, we're taking advantage of the washing facility so we're not going home with uh, a bunch of smelly clothes <clears throat> um, Luke's still having a chilled morning it's five past eleven Daisy and Tracy and I are going to hop on the bus over to Disney Springs um, because they want to do even more shopping and I might grab a beer or a cocktail somewhere and then we've got a really lovely lunch at the boathouse. Um, we love the boathouse, we've not been there so far this trip. So yeah, we'll see you at Disney Springs. So we're just about to hop on the ferry. Because of where our room's situated, we've got on the bus a lot more, haven't we? Yeah. And because the weather's been a bit pants, we've got on the bus a bit more, haven't we? Yeah. But what do we really like? <laughs> we love the ferry boat and especially on a day like today yeah, yeah. so we're gonna hop on head on down to Disney Springs <gasps> can do some more shopping What's it called? Sugar Bee. How good is it? Very good. It's beautiful, isn't it? Mm. Great music. That's lovely, that park, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's great. lunch. Pretty fancy start. It is. So Tracy and I went for the baked lobsters because we're a genius. <laughs> Daisy, what do you go for? <coughs> um, pasta. It's like vegetable pasta. And Luke, a little rabbit in the corner, went for some sort of award-winning burger. And we're hoping we don't get wet. I think the award is if you can finish it actually. <laughs> Breakfast. So, the most important thing about today is that that bird managed to open the packet of sugar that, that he's been fighting with and has finally had it. He's gone. Like How was your burger? Very nice. I, really nice. You, you had a bit. I had a bit. I think, think? I think it's the best burger I've ever tasted. Well, well good. Tracy and I had the baked lobster. So nice. Awesome. So nice. The, the baked, it was baked crab and stuffed inside it as yeah. well with like peppers and seasoning and cheese or something. Oh well, it was, it was really nice. Awesome. How was your veggie dish? Yeah, I had like a, a vegetable pasta. It was really good, but I'm so full. But the main thing is, the service has been amazing. Eric and Jason have looked after us amazingly. The sun's out. I wasn't sure about sitting out on this jetty at first because it's a bit wobbly. It does move. <laughs> but after you find your sea legs, the boathouse is on a winner. Because this is a restaurant we've kind of had, like we really, really liked or didn't like, or we. We're all a bit unsure about it, but this has cemented it. Oh, this yeah. experience has been great. Yeah, it's super lovely. What have you got? Um, sorbet. Um, Luke doesn't like eating in public, but always has two puddings and has to take them away in a bag. <laughs> that's, that's how it goes, yeah. What have we got? We have got key lime pie in a mason jar. 
looks pretty awesome. Get stuck in then. Good. Good. Going in. Get down to the biscuity bottom. Yeah. Oh, yeah, how's the biscuity bottom? The buttery biscuit base. How is it? <laughs> you wouldn't like it. Thank you. Open <laughs> <laughs> the bag, two puds. No. <laughs> it's delicious. The whole experience in Boathouse, I'm giving that a fat 10. Oh, 10 out of 10. Daisy. Boathouse. What do you think? It was bloody lovely. It was bloody no. lovely. Pull up. So it's our last night. I know, harsh. The weather has turned good for our last day, as always happens. Yeah, we had an amazing lunch at Boathouse. Boathouse. Yeah, it was, oh, it was lovely. We weren't overly hungry, so we thought we would go for something lighter in the seafood variety, but in the end it was quite a lot, as it always is. But it was really good, really good. Yeah, the staff in there were amazing, service was amazing, food was amazing. We sat outside on the kind of, it's like a, the bit where the bar is that's like on a little jetty, and it is literally like a pontoon, and where we were sitting, when we sat down, we just thought, whoa, it does actually move, so you have to be a bit careful there, um, if you're not expecting that, or if you are prone to motion sickness, might not be a good place to eat for you, because you might feel a bit queasy, or a bit seasick, but it, it worked for us, because it was outside, and it was nice weather, it's just nice to hang out there, it's beautiful. Yeah, I am prone to motion sickness, and when we first got out there, I was like, not <laughs> sure. Wonder, actually, yeah, okay. but I was fine, and it was awesome, really, really good. And I think, as we mentioned before, it, it's a restaurant that we kind of have a love hate relationship with. We've had some great meals there, we've sat outside before and got rained on before, um, but today is it's back in my firm favourites. Yeah, I think as well that we had two guys looking after us, Eric and Jason, who were brilliant. They were really helpful because we were trying to use up our table service allocation as well, and they were really flexible with that. Yeah. Um, and they were really helpful and chatty and just nice. You know, the, it, it, it's not a, it's not a quick serve, so therefore you know you are going to wait a little bit for them to prep things and get everything out to you, especially when you're on the little jetty bit because they're going to have to bring stuff from the main building out to you, so it does take a little bit longer. Um, get your stuff but we weren't in a hurry it was a nice chilled lunch we were having a nice time the weather was good a few black clouds came over but luckily they went away and it was just really really chilled and relaxed yeah it's really 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 good and although it's like a fine dining restaurant and it's probably not the best use of your um dining plan allowance luke had a burger in there it might be the best burger we've ever had <laughs> Oh, yeah, we ordered a bite. Yeah, it, it, it was really, really good. So now we are heading down to the pool for our last evening. Um, we might get something from... Oh, from Good Food to Go, which is the poolside snack bar up at the Hospitality House main area where the big main pool is. Yeah, but no one's super hungry, so we're just going to hang by the main pool this evening. And we're going to pop into the uh, shop just to get some snacks to take home. And just have a bit of a chill. There might be... Oh, what time is it? It's quarter past six. Movie. The, di the dive in movie. Yeah, so we might hang around for, for the poolside movie and just have a, a nice chilled evening. So potentially we might see you by the pool. So here we are, big sweet hall. Get a basket, girls. I have a friend and their vacation partner. And they're going to be I think you might need to ask if there's a basket. Oh, sweet. Oh, nice. See what you did there. Targets acquired. You might do. Right, so first thing you need to do is make sure that there are snacks on the dining plan. Daisy is in some sort of frenzy. It's my favourite. Don't forget, you've got to count. Three. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you look close at the sign here that makes you know that they are on the dining plan. So Daisy has already clocked early well, on the holiday. Favorite, I can know what. Oh, how many you got now? Four. Well done. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, I'd like to get some of these, but yeah. I don't want to get them until it's time to go home. So I don't think they're going to last. Well, if they're not going to last, I think we should go for non-perishables. Those look so nice. 
Well, we're saving Sober till tomorrow. Okay, yeah. We decided to save a few best snacks over till tomorrow just to make sure we don't run out and just do the last, last yeah. tour. We can do that just before we get the bus tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> written books, some have a great look that covers the magazines for kids who are 17, but I don't know what to do, staring into the blue sky and just waiting for a sign. How do we do? We did really well. We've still got 11 quick serves left, so. And 40 bags of sweets. <laughs> Lots of sweets. <laughs> yeah, interesting enough, you can't convert the quick serves into snacks anywhere else but in the resort shop. Oh, cool. Well, we've just got back from the pool. Yep. Had a super night there. Our last night at the well, we think we're at the pool tomorrow, but it's our last night at the pool. Yeah, really, really nice. Had a little bite to eat, a couple of sal salads and some bits and pieces. Cashed in all of our snacks, but we've done a separate video about that because it was pretty. We got we got a whole bunch of <laughs> pretty sweets. Pretty epic, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> On your last night or the day before, you get this. That's your marching orders. Yeah, going envelope home of, em, envelope of sadness <laughs> yeah, but, or as daisy called the bus that you get here when you when you arrive is called the magical express and daisy called it and she's not claiming this as her own i think this is it she's heard it from someone else and... the tragical express because we don't want to go home yeah so we're getting back we're gonna what we've got back we're gonna uh, watch a bit of telly and just have a chilled one i think it's about half past nine and then uh, we're going to get up early, get everything squared away, and hopefully get down to the pool for just after nine, put our bags with bell services, and have a morning around the pool. I think the Tragical Express is picking us up at half past one and taking us to Orlando. Um, so yeah, we will see you in the morning. Cheers, Iz. <laughs>